Okay, just ignore everything we just did. We're gonna take redo two. it. Take two. <laughs> take two. Yeah. We're on we're on the Wi Fi here now. Yes. Yeah, I didn't realize um there were issues with Wi Fi. We always check that area. before we go live. Just yeah, to probably see what's going a good on. idea. Yeah. <laughs> well, happy Wednesday if you didn't catch our happy hump day. <laughs> oh my goodness. Over here at Bar Louie, um, we were just talking about how they um, I noticed that they had a brunch here. So if anybody wants to try that out, I don't know about it than that but maybe somebody will come by and they can tell us more about it yeah nice another um, employees option. totally love when we grab them and say hey we're live come over here and talk They're yeah like, oh, <laughs> I know, <we're laughs> but they all you know what's so funny is everybody that's nervous about it always feels a great job yes. you know yes. they're it's like just that initial shock of getting in front of the camera yeah, you're like people are watching and then you get over it yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly <laughs> Now we're never nervous, right? Never. We're like, ah, oh, let's just see what happens. Cool. <laughs> so what? So uh, yeah, what's going on? What are you doing this week? Um, well, I'm going out on Saturday night. Oh yeah, where are you going? I have Marina. a special. I have a special oh. date with somebody. <laughs> oh yeah, I already forgot. I think with Leslie and she already forgot. Yeah. <laughs> so we will be. Um, yeah, we're we're gonna be. Filming going in, so we'll, we'll talk about this. Spoiler alert! No, <laughs> no we'll be filming um, going Gainesville at the Dirk Bentley concert and Chippy Loop. I'm so, so excited! We'll be, like, I haven't been all season, so yeah, me neither. And we'll be able to like, you know, kind of have access. Well, obviously, we have permission to be filming there and all that stuff. So, so cool! Awesome. I'm so excited. <laughs> Are we gonna have the microphones? Yeah, but yes. we'll have our microphones. I love that. I love that. <laughs> it's gonna feel like somebody off of. Uh, like what is that? Access Live. Um, yeah. <laughs> I love it. And we'll we'll get to guess, interview all the people that maybe had a little too much to drink. Lo oh, I love that. The concert. Oh, that's so fun. <laughs> <laughs> Although we might be one of them. No, no, <laughs> no. no. <laughs> after no, that'll be after the after party. <laughs> hey Barbie. Hey Brad. <laughs> so other than the Dirk Bentley concert this weekend, there's some really good live music this weekend, and it's my birthday. Friday. No way! <laughs> we'll be partying for my birthday. Where are we celebrating? Dirk Stanley. No. <laughs> are you going to do family on Friday? Probably family on Friday, and then uh, we're doing uh, the concert, so I'll be booked up with that, and then some, maybe someday I'll do something during the day. Brunch. Or, yeah. Brunch. 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 Yeah. Probably. Who wants, Birthday to, who wants to take me? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hey, Heather. Hi, Deanna. Hi, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Well, do you want, since we've been talking about music already with, with uh, Dirks? Yes, yes, so uh, Farm Live, music? as usual, has music all the time, a couple different uh, people hey, all Linda. weekend, and we're starting today at 5 p.m. with Ed Schnittinger, I hope oh, I'm saying that right, good at all yep, that was close, <laughs> uh, tomorrow at 5 p.m. is Charles Parker, then Friday at 2 p.m. is James Stevens. He's local, been in the, the scene forever. He used to be in a band called When in Rome, I believe. Okay. Um, really, really talented guy. Um, local favorites, one of my favorites on Friday at 6.30 is Living the Dream. We love those guys. They're wonderful. You have to check them out. Um, Saturday at 11 a.m. is John Cresswell. Saturday at 2.30 is Chris Timbers Band, which I've heard of, but I don't know what kind of music they do. Um, Saturday at 5.45 is Jarrell Williams Experience. Saturday at 9 is Pandora's Box, the ultimate Aerosmith tribute band. Oh, that's cool. Doesn't that sound fun? Yeah, I love that tribute fun. bands. That's yeah, me too. That's going to be so fun. Um, then um, uh, Sunday is David Andrew Smith. I've seen him before. He's really talented too. And then Sunday at 4.30, wrapping it up, is Rock Creek Kings. Cool. Yeah, a lot of good bands this weekend. I'm so excited. So I tried to go last week and see the like, library. And there was a monsoon. Right. <laughs> it was the weather was crazy. Yeah, it just like right when they started performing, it rolled through, and we were like completely soaked, and we were like, I don't want to be here, yeah. like, and feel time to find nasty. someplace dry. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was oh, that was fun. my last. Yeah, that storm came through really fast last week. Performance it was that crazy. I tried to see. <laughs> Mother Nature yes. I was trying to ruin things. <laughs> Um, and then um, yesterday was the first time I've ever been in Uptown Alley. Which, oh, really? Yeah, I had never been in there. Um, my daughter wanted to go play some games and, Did and she check it out. It? She loved it. Yeah, oh I'm my sure. gosh, she loved it. Yeah, right. So, and really my mom was too. shocked that they have bands there. So she's like, "Yes, book your band here. We have to come back here." Oh yeah, that would be awesome. So yeah, it's, it. it's a fun place. I've heard lots of good things about it. 
Um, so over there they have For the Win on Friday night at 8.30 and at 8.30 on Saturday is Steve's, which is 100% 80s hair metal strikes back. Now that which sounds, sounds awesome. really cool. Hi Sherry. Which <laughs> sounds really awesome fun. To me. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we should go see this 80s hair, hair band. <laughs> Come on, that would be so Sherry. fun. <laughs> <laughs> she likes country, but I know she could get down to some 80s hair metal for sure. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Alright, you want to do a couple? Yeah, no, I'll do a couple. Um, I well I should I should I do you want to do that one? Mm. Since we already talked about it. I'm gonna get that one. Okay, so I won't bother with that one. Yeah. So we've got um, on July the 11th, which is tomorrow, is the Brains and Beer Trivia, Weekly Trivia at Tin Cannon Brewery. I'm doing Gainesville stuff now. Um, we've got on Friday night is Friday Night Lights Party at Rockwoods. I think that's every every Friday. On, oh, that's, oh, do you have this? Uh, stuff I too? think so. Okay, yeah, so I'm, I'm doing a clip. You can do a clip. Yep. Yep. Um, throwback Thursdays at Rockwood uh, tomorrow at 9. They're having, obviously, just throwback music. I'm not sure how far back we're throwing it, but <laughs> <laughs> it's, back, it's back somewhere. <laughs> um, on Friday, there's a 3 p.m. Virginia Gateway. I don't know exactly where, but they're having a blood drive. I saw that. Yeah, that's, that's awesome really if you can go home. Yes. Go home. Important. No, I'm the type of person that faints if I get Oh, no. Okay, <laughs> Although I still suffered it. through it to get a free day out of high school once. Oh and then they God. fill up the whole big bag. And I was oh, like walking just... around, I'm like, I feel lighter. Because all my blood's gone. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> Andrea! Hi, um, <laughs> guys. Hi, Lavana. So, blood drive. If you're not a wuss like me, go to that. Um, <laughs> July 14th. There's the uh, Mopar Club Sunday Fun Day up at Mazda 29, so that you bring your car out there, and uh, if you're a car person, and you can, that's a cool place to go. Um, oh, now I'm on to Haymarket. Do you uh, want to right. do the um, I got, uh, oh, you go ahead, I have that. I'll skip that one. You okay. Do you do look great. All right, so the 12th, Friday, Thanks, is Lavana. Ladies' Night. Hi, <laughs> Lavana. Um, the 12th is Ladies' Night at 5 p.m. at Winery at LaGrange. So go on out there. They have uh, live music, wine, food, and vendors. Oh, it was originally supposed to be July 5th. So they moved it. I guess they had bad weather or something. And then on the 13th, Puppies and Planks. At 11 a.m. at Winery so at range. Cute. I know it's like join us um, at ja at the vineyard as Jazzercise Haymarket Fitness Center walks you through a strength 60 class with puppies. With puppies. Yes. Everything's better with puppies. Yes, it's so true. Andrea Payne knows that. <laughs> yeah, with puppies. Andrea Payne. <laughs> she knows. It. Yes, she does. Dog stay out. If you guys don't know Andrea Payne, uh -huh. she and her husband own that fabulous spot over in Haymarket. Yeah, this. Pretty new, but awesome. Yes. And doing super well. Yes. Um, July 11th, which was uh, tomorrow, is week 10, my rhymes are running thin. I don't know what that is. Um, that's all that printed off, but it's something else at Winery at LaGrange. There's always fun stuff going yes. on over there. And of course, tastings, you know, go and meet with the people that work there. They're super fun. Yeah, and then this is cool. Um, July 13th, teacher appreciation event, Saturday at 12.30 p.m. at um, the Wal at Walmart in Haymarket. Oh. Thank you, teachers. We're celebrating you and all your hard work. Join us uh, this weekend for a teachers-only event, complete with cake, ice cream, cold drinks, photo booths, goodie bags galore. That's fun. Yeah, I know a ton of teachers. So nice. I'll have to send them over that. there. Yes. I know they deserve it. They work so hard all year. Samantha! <laughs> They definitely do. I mean, it's so nice that they're doing that. I didn't really realize like Walmart did an event like that. Like so that's stuff. neat. Yeah. yeah, that is really another cool. venue for I like, all the people. I like about. when you see a big box store like that do something for the community. I that's do too. Really cool. Yeah. So I mean, it makes you feel like you know that obviously they they care about other things. With what else going on around here, like on a local level? Yep. That's awesome. Hi, Tanya. Um, Hello. Let's see here. I've got on July. Well, they have the food truck at Farm Brewery at Broad Run. They have burnt ends there and the Frenchman's food truck. Um, oh, those are good. And then, let's, well, oh, I already said that. That was the Frenchman's truck. 
the 12th at 6 p.m. Acoustic, acoustic music, acoustic music with purpose at the Farm Brewery. So if you wanted to listen to acoustic music, I don't know who's there, but um. Oh wait, I think I have that. Hold well on, hey bitch. Hey in there. Hold on, where is it? Oh yes, yeah, um, at the Farm Brewery. Right? Farm Brewery. Yeah. Uh, is the 13th is Time Warp and Brian Frankie on uh, on the 14th. Oh, cool. And he's really good. I've seen him a bunch of times. Super nice guy too. Awesome. And then I've got one more thing to talk about that's in uh, Haymarket, but DK Wolf Rocks Giuseppe's. So I guess that's some. I don't. I don't know what that means. I don't, I don't know if it's a music group. It says. Yeah, it doesn't say I that on too. July 13th at 8 p.m. If you want to go to Giuseppe's, check check that out and get more details. Yep. Um, I've got Sinistral this okay. weekend. Our friends over at Sinistral. Hi guys. Uh, we've got Katie and Kelly live on uh, Friday at 7 p.m. And then um, on Saturday at 12 p.m. they have a salsa pop-up with Daddy G. So I don't know what that's all about, but that sounds really fun. Yeah, wasn't that the actual, not like salsa dancing, salsa eating? I don't know. I think, well, I feel like we saw that somewhere before, like in another I know, I'm never, I'm one. never sure, but either way I like both. Yeah, either so one I'm happy. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> and my shameless plug, on the 20th at Sinistral, my band A Track Jones will be doing their Christmas in July. Oh, um, so that's coming up soon. Mark your calendars for that one. Awesome. Um, and then, uh, Sinistral has op open mic night uh, every Thursday, and First Fridays, um, they have their First Friday music um, series as well. Oh, I forgot to print out the Manassas one where they do it on the, in the middle there. I'll, I'll get that one for next week, but always go and check out, I think it's the Old Town Manassas, <laughs> is it called Music on the on the Green or something like that, but they have that music every weekend. Sounds good. I just I mean, I made <laughs> music that up. On the I made that up. <laughs> um, it's in that little pavilion. Um, and then, um, that's all I have for Sinistral, and we already did Farm Brew, so I'm, we're just flying through these today. Oh, yeah, well, uh, we know it would probably be a quicker Yeah, this one's a quicker one. one. It's no, no holidays or anything going Yeah, on. we're not, and we're not hot, drinking not hot. cocktails and being crazy. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know, no cocktails today. We need to make these longer. I know, I, I know. Drink. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> and as always, if you'd like to be a guest, Please let us know if you'd like to come and promote your band or promote an event that you're doing. We love having special guests. So that always makes it longer too because there's more to talk about. Yes. So. Oh, he's asking what's going on on Saturday, on Saturday day. I don't know. You're going to have to tailgate at Dirk's Bentley <laughs> parking lot. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I don't know of any. I, I'm during the day. Well, other than what you, yeah, you've I've gone through. I don't know music. if we have any like picnic or anything going on. Well, we'll see if there's anything more on yeah. my list. I've we have something some fun more. coming on Sunday. I'm about to get to that one. Uh, Eclipse, we've got Screaming Monkeys. Those are good friends of mine. Jeff Wingrove is an old friend, and they're an awesome, awesome yeah, rock band. they are really good. Really good. Uh, this is super fun. This is one Sherry will love if she's watching. An ACDC tribute, Halfway to Hell, too. is on Saturday at 9. I think Sherry might have already seen them over at, um, they, I know they saw a tribute band to ACDC, but I don't know if they and then, this is what I've been excited about, <laughs> and I'm really going to try and go, is the Hustling in Heels Drag Brunch on Sunday <laughs> at, what time does it start? Sunday at noon, I think. Um, so, forget everything you know about brunch, grab your cash, your best friends, your sisters, aunties, and mamas, then head over to Eclipse's newest drag queen brunch. It's about time you let out your inner, let out your inner diva, come enjoy great food and drinks while enjoying a fabulous drag show starring some of DMV's top female impersonators. Hosted by Sweet Tea and starring Jayla Nicole, Kendra Lattimore, and Katja Attention. That's Isn't awesome. Isn't that a great name? <laughs> I, love I love that. that. Hi, Michelle. <laughs> Michelle, you want to go to the drag brunch on Sunday? Yes. I that seriously so think fun. we should just round up a whole bunch of people and go because I've always wanted to do the ones in Arlington and DC and I just. It's one of those bucket list things. So yeah, if anybody so wants now to go, we can, we can do. There's like on a local level. Yeah, I do do so many cool things. There. I saw I know, midget I know. wrestling is coming back. They, oh, I put that sold out last time there. Yeah, it did. It did. So, so I, when I went on, I think it's like further out, so it didn't like yeah. burn out for this week. But I was like, yay! The, I know. Eclipse, midget wrestling. Eclipse it's always has the best stuff going on. <laughs> Jason, Jason's so smart. I think we should go do that too. I know. Okay, so now, now Leslie and I have meetings for the day. <laughs> I'm gonna see midget. Right, we yeah. no. <laughs> I'm going to go 
whole new thing. thing. That's the going that's game. That's a whole new thing. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. So that's Sunday afternoon. Um, we'll have to look into see if there's anything going on. On oh yeah, Screaming Monkeys are really good. They're they're such a fun band. They've got lots of energy. They play everything you want to hear. They're right. awesome. Yes. And I think that's all I've got. Okay. Well, I've got some stuff in. I think just in Warrington left that I wanted to go through. If you can make it out today, they're having how fun is this crab cake happy hour in the garden at Ooh. Wild Hair Hard Cider. So you can go have crab cakes and drink some really good. hard cider. Um, that's it. That's like I said, four today, four to seven. Um, let's see what else. July 11th, which is tomorrow at 5 p.m. Cruising 29 at Northside um, Summer Car Show. So that's at the Northside 29 restaurant oh, there. That one's so cute. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Do you even know like where 29 is blocked off? You know how they're oh, like, yeah. It? Yep. Um, that's actually a good point. Um, 29 is blocked off just past Vin Hill Road. Okay. And it's rerouted a couple different ways, but if you're heading towards Warrington, it's going to be a little bit of a mess this week. Okay. Yeah. So, so. And I think it's going on for quite a while. Yeah. Like a while. Yeah. So crazy. that's going to be that's going to be crazy. My mom and dad live on the route that they're rerouting everybody. My mom said it took her six minutes to get across the street to get the mail. Oh my god. Just waiting for cars to go by. Yeah, would drive and she crazy. said, and then she got stuck on the other side. And get back. <laughs> oh, <poor mom. laughs> she was probably waving. Her <laughs> that's hilarious. Yeah, so it's, yeah, they're on the, uh, the the bypass route, so not fun for them. Right I know now. it's like yeah. causing so many like you know probably congestion and other yes, areas where people are yes. used to. Yes. Um, hey, from how oh, cool? From wait, if you're into cigars, oh yes, Rich, you should go to that. Tobaccoology is so fun. <laughs> um, mom, mom, mom. Okay, so we did that. So, so go there. Uh, classic cars. Bring the family out to enjoy the show. All ages are welcome. We'll have live music, drink specials, um, chips and salsa, trophies and prizes for car show participants. And then um, July 11th at 6 p.m. Tapas, tasting and tunes at Farm Station Cafe in Warrington, right there up by um, the Old Mustard Brewery and up Fin Hill Road. Um, <clears throat> on the oh, where is that? Uh, we'll skip that one. Want to hear a funny sure. story about tapas? Yes. I got asked out on a date when I was in my twenties, and the guy asked me to go to a tapas bar, and, and I thought he said a tapas, tapas bar. bar. <laughs> I was so offended. He was like, <laughs> "Why? What, what, what kind of there? a woman do you think I am?" First date. Like, <laughs> Oh, Lord. Now, oh. now she's talking about going to bra drag bar. <laughs> but not a tapas bar. No, no, no. no. <laughs> um, oh, this one sold out. Bob, are they? I've seen this a couple times. Um, they have the paranormal tour and investigation oh. in Falkir. In, in That's cool. There's so, so much history in Falkir County. Yeah, That's I would awesome. love to do that sometime. Bob, aren't sold out, they but keep your eye out. too, right? The, the ghost tours or I whatever. I think so. And maybe even like these bars. Yeah, I've seen them a couple places that's around here. Although I say it's fun, but I probably yeah, get freaked like out and for the never next sleep <laughs> six months. <laughs> I'm afraid to go in the dark we'll, in my house. And we'll come back and be like, "Don't go to the house." Oh right. my god, don't do it. It could be like whenever I was younger, I stopped watching like all horror movies. Whenever oh, yeah. I would, I sort of walk. If my parents weren't home, I was like 13. I'd walk around the house with a pillow over my chest in case. <laughs> Someone tried to stab me in the oh heart. God. It would give me panic. <laughs> like the knife couldn't get through the pillow. Oh my god. So I was like, this is not good. I gotta stop watching. This is the episode of Becky and Love. <laughs> embarrassing <laughs> stories right. of their past. It's perfect. Um, this is the dirt everybody needs. Right. <laughs> and Leslie's got a pillow on her chest. She's no, like walking around with a pillow. <laughs> Um, so we got on. They have the farmers market there in Warrenton. I think it's every Saturday. I was I was there one one Saturday, um, and it was really good, very fresh. <clears throat> they have their farmers market July thirteenth um, again Saturday at eight a.m. It's located in the parking lots between Fifth and Lee Streets in Old Town Warrenton. Um, oh, uh, let's see here. Oh, I think that was it. That's it. All right. I guess. Well, really quick, um, yeah, I'd like to give a couple you. shout outs. And you've got to do Nolly Pop. Yes, I've got to do Nolly Pop and a couple quick shout outs. Um, my daughter is here. We've had the best week. Go climb on the table. Come around if you want to say hello. Oh, yeah, that, that'll monkey. fall off. Um, <laughs> um, she's been with me all week. I've been dragging her around to work stuff and all kinds of things that we've been doing. But she had a really cool. She's high on Um, there she is. Do you want to tell them about your experience at Firebird? No. Here, come 
just want to know what happened. Why don't you tell them? It'll sound cooler coming from you. Well, they uh, saw no, her. So now you know who the story's going yes. to Yes. So we just went for lunch, you know, just casually, me and my mom and Grayson. And the manager, I can't remember his name now. It's probably, it's in the Is poster. It or probably the yeah, exact I, I can't remember. Yeah. Um, he came over and told us to stick around after we paid our bill. And he made Grayson an honorary chef. That's with so a fun. cool t-shirt that looks like a chef's jacket, the real hat, not a paper hat, right. the real hat, and he, he like shook her hand and she gave him the biggest hug and he said, you know, for our very special guests, we like to put them in the honorary chef club. And it was just such a great experience and I made a post about it is, this is kind of why I like doing this show with you. Right. Because like, this area is just wonderful. The local businesses are wonderful, and Firebirds is a chain. Yeah. But the manager really—I don't think they do that at every Firebird. So it yeah, was—that's really nice. It was really, I've never heard of that. It before. was really cool. And then the next day, we went over to see my friends at Shining Soul Candle Company in Old Town Manassas, uh -huh. and we were out just picking out candles. And Ray Madonna was there. Um, my friend Pete Evick owns it, and Ray Madonna was there, who's also a musician, who's in one of the bands that we've talked about, and I think it was called Re Revenge Renegade something. Uh, I'll have to apologize later that I didn't get right. Um, so they do make your own candles there, oh, which is fun. super cool. I thought it was just events, like on the weekend. Any day you go in and they have the, the wax all melted, you can pick your color, your scents, um, the special jars you want, whatever size you want. So Grayson got to make her own candle, Aww. and she decided to go with a, yeah, a jar say, that what has... What color did you do, Grayson? Always. Always purple. That's yeah. what I like, too. Yes. And I also did a gold case. Yes, gold well, leaf. They, they put this gorgeous gold leaf on the outside of the jar. So when inside. you put the wax in, or yeah, the inside of the jar. Sorry, Grace. Um, so it's all stuck on the edges. And she picked uh, lavender vanilla, and it smells amazing. It's oh, the woodwick cool. candles. If you guys haven't been to Shining Soul in Old Town Manassas, please go over there. Well, that's a fun activity for kids yeah. to do, like over the summer. You're like, what, else, what more can I do with my kids? Yeah. And you don't want to go to like the movies or whatever. You're sick of things. Like, yeah. You know, that's kind of like along the lines of like Muse Tea Bar. Yeah. It's so fun. Just something like, interesting. To, yep. You know, have you ever gone to Muse Tea Bar? I haven't. So I always tell, I gotta do a video on them sometime because I love them and what I love about them is I always say, like Chloe likes to go there oh, and it's nice. like what other place can you go to and have like two hours of uninterrupted yeah. time that you're actually talking, you're not sitting yep. in a movie theater, watching a movie, yeah, you're not it's doing really an activity where you're ice skating or something, which all right. those are great but but it's nice to, you, like, to communicate. Yeah, yeah, you're right next to them. You're bonding. Yes. Yeah, it's creativity. Oh, that's great. Yeah, that so, with you. so oh, yeah, it's wonderful. So I, I bet like Grace would love that. that. Yeah, you guys we'll should to... go. I've taken Ryan. Oh, He's okay. So seven. it's for little ones too. I mean, you can take whoever there. Oh, and of course, funny. Ryan's like, I hate my painting. It's not as good as yours. Oh, it's better. I'm eye of the beholder for sure. Oh, that's great. Well, I just wanted to say thank you to those two local businesses for making my kid feel really special. And she really and enjoyed that. And probably any kid that would come through. So everybody yes. go visit them and yes. check them out. Yep. And, and lastly, um, at the farm, uh, Brewery Broad Run is an Pop all Yay! weekend from 12 to 6. And we actually just got a huge, That's what huge, I was huge, huge new stuff. Oh my god. Oh my god. We've yeah. got the most beautiful new stuff. This top, I don't know if you guys can see this new top. We got a lot That's of cute. leopard stuff in, I kind of getting leopard. ready for the fall. Mm -hmm. But we've got um, high-waisted paper bag shorts and two different types of, um, it's a, like a gray leopard and then the, this traditional leopard. Um, three or four maxi dresses, a few rompers, um, oh, some love. other shorts. Um, check that out. Oh my gosh, love there's some it. really cute stuff. Yourself. And 17 dozen new pairs of sunglasses. Oh, that's sunglasses are my obsession. I know. Uh, a ton of new are jewelry. So fun. There's so much new stuff going on. So definitely swing by the farm brewery because they have tons of stuff going on anyway. And you can shop. Yeah, next time um, we do want to be a new stuff we can bring them and we can Oh, that's oh, a great yeah. idea. Wonderful. <laughs> so people can see. Yes, oh, that would be great. And go like the Nollipop page and then you can see all the stuff that Becky posts because she posts pictures of like the models wearing it or yes. different. Stuff so you can kind of get a feel for what she does out of her cool mobile phone. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess that's it for this week. Thanks everybody for tuning in. Again, if you know of something you want us to talk about, let us know. Post pictures. Yeah. And if you'd like to host with us, yes, come on out and meet us. We're we're always um, 
looking for people that want to chit chat with us about yeah, hang out. nothing and everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. Well, thanks for joining yeah. me. And um, bye guys. We're out of here. Have a, Have great, a great week. week.